At a time when the Navy has proposed the procurement of three additional Calvary class submarines with AIP system and increased indigenous content, media reports indicate that the follow up order will come with a potential increase in cost. India signed a contract for six Calvary class submarines in October 2005, and the cost of each submarine was $625 million. Considering inflation and various other factors, it is estimated that the cost of three more Calvary submarines might experience a significant 46% increase in price to reach around $950 million per submarine, mainly due to impact of inflation on the overall production expenses and inclusion of the AIP plug, and the cost might reach $1 billion if the Navy decides to upgrade the internal combat management system and sensors. Mazagin Dock Ship Builders has revealed its mine countermeasures swarm system during the Lima 2023 Defence Exhibition in Malaysia, that will consist of three integral units, in which the first day UV will assume the role of the master, the second day UV will specialize in mine detection, while the third day UV will possess the capability to neutralize identified mines. The AUVs will weigh 60 kilograms, and will operate at a speed of 4 knots for a period of 4 hours, and will also have a payload capacity of 7 kilograms. The AUVs will be capable of launch and recovery from Indian Navy ships and torpedo tubes of submarines. The Indian Ministry of Defense is procuring 10 special operations assault craft for the Indian Navy. It will have a maximum speed of more than 40 knots with maximum payload, and endurance of more than 400 nautical miles, a carrying capacity of 8 personnel including crew. It will have sufficient integral firepower and intelligence surveillance and reconnaissance capability for conduct of special operations at sea and in shallow waters. The Indian Army will procure 590 FRCV in the first phase, but there has been a significant revision of the parameters for the FRCV after observing the new level of challenges faced by Russian tanks in Ukraine. The FRCV has now shifted towards a heavier 57.75-ton tank configuration with enhanced protection and increased firepower with 120mm gun and above caliber. Apart from onboard drones 360 degree vision coverage see through armor and soft kill and hard kill system, the army has also sought missile warning system, laser warning system, and the ability to suppress various signatures for stealth capability, such as acoustic visual infrared thermal and electromagnetic signatures to reduce its observability by 50%. After extensive discussions and consultations between Maruti Suzuki and the Indian Armed Forces, Maruti is now considering the production of a five-door variant of its Jimny, to meet the requirements of the Indian Armed Forces. It will increase seating capacity and cargo volume for military operations, a rugged and durable exterior for demanding terrains and weather conditions, and it will seamlessly navigate challenging terrains. The Chetak Corps, a distinguished unit of the Indian Army, has been chosen to represent India at the prestigious Cambrian Patrol 2023, showcasing India's military prowess on an international platform. The Cambrian Patrol is an annual international military exercise held in the rugged terrain of Wales in the United Kingdom. It tests the mettle of participating teams through a series of physically and mentally demanding challenges, testing endurance and tactical expertise. <laughs>